Hello, everyone, and welcome to the episode of The Coding Cube. Today's guest, we have Karthik. How are you doing today? Yeah, good. Hi, right, good. Thank you for joining us again. Mm-hmm. All right, so Karthik, uh, what's your role here at Sync Fusion? Yeah, I'm software product manager. Mm-hmm. I'm a founder of Angular and Lea, and Angular JS client set frameworks. I'm doing a couple of components in Essential JS to shoot in all the frameworks. Hi, right, that sounds great. Yeah. So, what do you have planned for us today? Yeah, I'm going to talk about Angular semantics for Essential JS to Angular shoot. Oh, yeah, that sounds awesome. Well, I guess let's go ahead and get started. Yeah. Semantics. Semantics is yeah, Angular powerful tool which is used to reduce the development configuration steps. Uh, we have integrated Angular semantics in our Essential JS2 Angular suits, which help our customers and users to easily configure our components in Angular CLI environment. Now we are going to talk about um, basic and uh, traditional Angular CLI application integration steps for a component. For example, we are going with a grid component. Grid has yeah, several little features, but we are talking about grid getting started. In getting started of a grid, we have to create an Angular CLA application. Before that, we have to install the Angular CLA globally in our machine. After that, we have to create a new Angular CLA application, and then we have to install Angular package and register a grid model and then again include the CSS references. After that only, we have to include our grid component. This is called our simulation grid. After that, we can populate our data to achieve the below output. Same getting started steps are same for all, all the essential days to Angular components. Now, we are going to reduce these steps such called registering in grid model, CSS references, grid component addition, all these steps by running simple ng add command. So let's show for a demo. Yeah, okay. Sounds great. Yeah. I'm going to create a new Angular CLA application, which is called Simpson App. which has a couple of inputs. Those are routing and style sheet. We can enable routing for any application. Style sheet, we can go with CSS, SAS, something. Yeah, this is routing. Style sheet format, we can go with CSS, SAS, CSS list, style list, anything. We can down arrow, use the down arrow, you can select any one style sheet. We can go with CSS. These inputs will create an Angular CLA application and install the required packages to run the basic Angular CLA application in our environment. Yep. The installation is got over. The environment is ready for our development. This is a basic Angular CLA application. We can open CD. This will compile the CLA application and open in browser. Yeah. The basic Angular CLA application is ready. Now we are going to integrate our sync vision. Angular, any one of the number. For example, we are going to integrate list two component in this CLA application with just only one command. Okay, yeah, nice. Yeah. This command will install the Angular list package and configure the list view, mo- list view module in the CLA application. Okay, yeah. Yeah, we will check the differences after the intelligent command. Yeah, installing the packages by npm. And these are the files. We made we made a modification to configure the list view component. Okay, nice. 
In Angular JSON file, by default, the material thing will be included in package.json. In the add package will be included. No need to worry about the package version. This will be our NPM package latest version. And then the default material thing will be included in the application. Oh, nice. So, say I wanted to change themes, how would I go about doing that? Yeah, that would be very easier. While ng add, it would be a package name. For example, in this case, list iPhone iPhone theme. We have four different themes fabric, bootstrap, material, and high contrast. Yeah. By default, the material theme will be injected into Anglo CL application. If we wanna to change this, we can input the theme in command itself. This will inject the chosen theme into Anglo CL application. Okay, yeah, this is easy enough. Yeah. In style CSS, the style will be included. Applet model RTS. Next view model alone will be injected into Apple model TS file and then imported in the same list view model will be imported in import style. Okay, yeah. Okay. How can I include only the required modules? Yeah. For example, the pop up package have multiple models like tooltip, dialog, some other packages. So we include specific modules through models property these are report make use of this output and include if we know tooltip sorry ng add for example easy to hyphen angle hyphen pop-ups and the models are you can use tooltip alone this will include the tooltip module alone in applet model it is fine Nice. Okay, yeah. Now we are going to include list view sample. The Angular CLI provides generate command to include the samples or component files to include any syncfusion sample. For example, here we can include list view default sample. After the installation, we are going to include a list view default sample in CLI environment. You can check the changes in tooltip balloon will be included in Apple model that is by after that we are going to include sample for list view. There ng generate command user to include sample for each drive and angle list package list view default sample. This name is used for sample component. The list receiving default sample will be created in the folder of syncfusion hyphen list. You can check the reference app syncfusion list. This is the default list with the data source of data, data which is available in TS file, which will be generated using ng generate command. If you know more about the samples available in syncfusion list view, you can check known models at syncfusion and EG to angular list package inside that semantics folder and the generator. You can check the available samples. You can include the 
replace the list view hyphen default with the folder name available inside the generator. You can generate the samples in your Angular CLA application. Perfect. Yeah. Everything ready for application. We have to include the final step to include the routing for our newly created list view sample. I am just going to copy and paste the routes. List is a, a routing name for Angular list view. Okay. Now we are going to open the application in browser using ngzip command. This will compile the Angular CLA application and serve the application in Chrome browser. Nice. Oh, default browser. Yeah. Yeah. The application will be available in local 4200. We are going to route to a list to give the application. This is our sync vision list view. If you want to do any changes in list view display, you can make use of the sync vision list, sync vision list component.ts file. Just change any name. and save the file the angle of CLA will compile the application and serve the same in 4200 local cost you can replace at angular slash eg hyphen angular hyphen list with any essential js2 angular package to include our application in any CLA application. So um, this has all been released with the 2018 Volume 4 release with Syncfusion, correct? Yeah. Very nice. In our Volume 4 2018 release, we have included Angular Semantics for our entire All right. Well, thank you again for coming in and teaching us a little bit more about Angular Schematics. OK. And thank you all for joining us as well. If you'd like to learn anything more about Syncfusion or download any free products or samples, please visit us at syncfusion.com. And hopefully we'll see you next time. Thank you. We will see you in the next video.